Welcome to today's worship, and we are glad to gather with you this day and to have this time of fellowship and praise. And so our call to worship today comes from living faith, our calling. We are called. We are called to work out, work out the, meaning the meaning of, of our, own lives. our own lives. And to find our true vocation in the love and service of God. Serve and love God. Serve and love God. By the service and love of creation. By the service and love by the creation. Especially. Especially. The care of the needy. Care of the needy. Every kind of work that is honest and serves others is a vocation from the Lord. It is called means. All it means. The necessity, necessity to deny, to deny selfish, ambition selfish ambition and desire, desire in order, order to, to minister, minister to, to others. others. Okay. Together with me, in God's, God's service, service true, true freedom. freedom is to be found. Let us pray. Lord, we approach humbly, not because we are all capable, not because we've got everything going for us in what our hands hold, what our strength can do. But we know that in everything we're going to be facing, everything that you're calling us to be a part of, you will make sure that we are capable of our part. And so we put our trust in you. And we praise you, Lord, because that is always true. And we're going to struggle and we're going to stumble and we're going to fall and we're going to get some things wrong, and we do, Lord. We confess that we sin. Given every opportunity to do what is right, given all the commandments and guidance and what is good and what is not, Lord, we still sin. And we need your grace. And we need to be forgiven. And so, Lord, help us to feel that grace. Feel it pouring down on us like a refreshing rain. Lord, that heals us to the very depth of our soul. That our praise will be all the stronger. Our lives will be all the more joyful. And we lift those lives before you now. As we begin, as we begin, as we bring together our praise. And we do so sharing the words that Christ Jesus taught us. As we together say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. 